Hi friends, it's Nadi here. Welcome back. It's so beautiful out here today. It's like 70 degree and it's like what? It's 10, 15 in the morning guys. And it's so beautiful out here. This is Orlando weather. Really, really nice weather now. So we're really enjoying that. So I hope everybody's doing okay. I just want to do a short video. We did plant some winter vegetables, not much. We had the broccoli and cauliflower, and we did do a couple of cabbages. So I'll show you those. planted these um, we didn't plant much of them you know and it did take like about three months for them to get to this stage so these are so pretty I really like looking at these plants They're really beautiful to look at and um, so this is the cabbage and if you look the cabbage is now forming in there like it's now starting to fold in there. So you see it's now starting to form. That's the cabbage in there. It's a really beautiful plant. And I have another one here forming. Guys, I'm just going to pick this one. So this is so ready. And if you can see here, here that's another shoot coming out there so I'm just going to cut above that and this one is going to form another um, another florets of broccoli so I'm just going to leave this one so guys I'm just going to cut here how beautiful this is And you see this here, this is gonna form another florid. Let me show you the other plant. See this one here, this is the one, it was so small. And then I had harvest, I did harvest this one here. And then this one grew back here, so. Guys, I'm going to pick my cauliflower. So. so this is the cauliflower. And if you notice, I left this too long. I should have picked this earlier. So this one is not so big, but I'm gonna go ahead and pick it anyway. So guys, unlike the broccoli, this is just going to give you one cauliflower from each plant. This is a beautiful cauliflower. And we didn't use any, um, we didn't, we did not use any fertilizer or anything on these. It's beautiful. So look at this guys, my harvest for today. I have my broccoli and cauliflower. So on this side, we planted some pak choy and they're coming along nicely. They're going to be ready to harvest pretty soon. Look how healthy they are. Very nice. We didn't plant much of it, but um, you know, it's growing so nicely. And we did a, a new raised bed here. So this is like about six inches from the ground. And then um, we did it on both sides and we fill it in. It needs some more soil. After this harvest and um, 
So after this harvest, we're going to fill it in some more and then prepare to plant for the spring season. And on the same raised bed, we did some tomatoes. And they're coming along nicely. So look at this, uh, we had some freeze going on and um, you know, the leaves, some of them damaged, like look at the brown parts. And I'm really surprised that, you know, they held on, um, you know, because we went down to 30 degree. You know, look at this. I'm really glad they survived though. Um, let's take a look at this one. I was so happy when I came out and I saw after the frost and I saw my little tomatoes still held on. How pretty is that? And we have some more here. And in there we have some. So friends, I just came over by mom so you can see her cabbage also. So this is what it looks like when it's fully formed. Look at this one. So I think in a couple of days she can go ahead and harvest these. Really, really beautiful. Um, even if you don't get a cabbage, the plant itself is so pretty to look at. So my dear friends, thank you so much for watching and take care. If you haven't subscribed as yet, please do. Thank you so much once again.